Hi, this is Carl. Welcome to this very short video on squirrelsawvideo.com. Possibly you can give this a try if it works for you. Uh, let me know. Instead of having a lot of cords hanging around the bottom of my scroll saw for the light, possibly the air cleaner, which is over here also, possibly a Dremel that's hanging around if you need to drill some more starter holes, and of course for the scroll saw itself, I was going to hook up a power strip. such as this power strip. I was going to hook it up to the back of the scroll saw on the rear leg. But the uh, but the cord is only four foot long or so. This would have worked if I was close to the outlet. But since I go to many demonstrations, I take my scroll saw with me. And I never know in advance how far away the electrical outlet is going to be. So I'm going to show you what I come up with. Okay, this hose drill I found at Home Depot. I mounted it to my scroll saw stand. It has four outlet switch, an off and on switch, it has a handle, and it has this knob where you can roll up the cord very easily. So all I do is I plug in my light. Plug in my dust collector. I'll, and I'll plug in my scroll saw into this one of these outlets. And I can take this cord, pull it out, and go to several different outlets that are available. This cord is, I believe, it's either 16 or 20 feet long. Works perfect for my needs. So consider buying one of these if you do a lot of traveling or if you just want a handy place to plug in all your cords. I believe you'll be pleased with it like I am.